Okay, um, well, Apple released today iOS 5 Beta 4, the first over the air update. Let's go to settings, go to general, go to software update, checking for updates. And there it is, iOS 5 Beta 4, Apple internal 133 megabytes. Uh, contains some bug fi fixes and improvements. So let's hope so. I, I don't know. As far as I was concerned, Beta 3 was uh, buggier than the previous two. So, all right. So we're going to hit download and install. Let's see if this thing works. Important note: This is an Apple Commerce pre-release C, subject to license only. Yada yada yada, yada yada yada. Okay, I agree downloading so I right now I would imagine it should be uh, downloading that over my Wi-Fi we got about uh, two minutes remaining I think I'll probably end up show, throwing this up on YouTube means the video is going to be longer than a minute and I can't post any longer than a minute so, so this is pretty cool this um, um I want to thank Eric um, from our AT&T fan page for uh, noting this to me. Um, I don't know who, you know, I guess someone checks these every day. <laughs> I guess we'll check them now. But uh, sooner or later we knew this was coming. Two minutes remaining. That's a quarter of the way across. And I might stop this and uh, come back and uh, rejoin this uh, so you don't have to sit here and watch it uh, progress across. Although two minutes remaining is uh, staying there. Two minutes is quite a long time. There, less than a minute remaining. Okay, well, we might stay with this then. We don't want to miss something. Alright, just so you know, uh, this has been going on for, less than a minute, it's been going on for about 25 minutes now. So, 133 megs, and you know, I'm downloading it over Wi-Fi, so that shouldn't be the problem, but, um, you know, I don't know if this is being, it's saying downloading, I don't know if this is being implemented as it downloads, or getting real close to the end though so I want to stay with this just a little bit at the end there and then we'll see what happens from there to try to start oh, it's almost there I'm going to stay with this folks because it's, it's it's like almost there getting a little bit impatient with this though I'll tell you <laughs> oh wait will be installed in eight seconds your phone will restart then the installation is finished all right wow verifying update there we go Okay, there she goes, she's restarting. Hey, you can see, um, I'm using a Mophie Juice Pack Air. Uh, so I'm going to be traveling uh, on the plane, I can't, you know, uh, plug in, so I bought one of those. Lifted my screen shield though, I'm not happy with that, so I'll have to reapply another screen shield and yeah, give it another try putting it on without, uh, Lifted my screen shell. There it goes. It's restarting. I imagine we'll probably see an Apple logo with the status uh, update bar going across. Let's see here. Uh, there we go. We'll 
so we'll see how long this is going to last. So yeah, I got the Mophie Juice Pack Air. Uh, it's 1500 milliamp uh, extra. Um, I could have went for the Plus, which is a 2000 milliamp battery, but the uh, the Juice Pack Air is actually a little more stylish. You can see the, the the metal band that goes around the outer edge. It just looks nicer. The other one is just straight black, straight black around the edge. Um, just didn't look as nice and. I don't know if you're going to put a case, I kind of like it to look, you know, somewhat uh, stylish or nice. Alright, so we're not getting any status as far as uh, the update being installed across on that bar. So, so the download was less than a minute for 25 minutes, and so we'll see, uh, oh, we're just getting a little bit, there we go, we're going across. this a little steadier. Sorry folks, I'm just uh, as I said I'm taking this with my iPad 2. Um, now regretting that, I could have stuck this underneath my uh, HD camera and let it run until it was finished and then edited it from uh, the computer, but uh, I thought this would be just a quick install, but uh, obviously not. Okay folks, it's getting down towards the end here. I thought I'd rejoin um, one of the things in the previous uh, beta updates is, is this neat little enlarged Apple logo that kind of zooms out towards you. At least that's the way it's happened on mine. I think the first time, the other two I just let install and I guess I didn't see it, so, but the first one um, did that. Let's see if this, this one does that too. There we go, and uh, I think we're restarting. Okay, that's interesting. That should just zoom right across there. There we go. See if that Apple logo zooms out. Nope, didn't do that. Okay. All right, folks, well...